We just wanted to see if uh, we can get a balloon to float by putting hydrogen in it. And uh, to get hydrogen, we're just going to use uh, a little bit of lye water and some aluminum. Wrap a balloon around the neck of this bottle and I don't know, see if see if it floats. I should be using gloves and have glasses on and stuff, but that's not what I do. Um, but don't be fooled, this stuff will burn right through you. <laughs> and it'll be a pretty bad chemical burn too. Oh yeah. Just so you know. I'm about to try and pour this in here. And There it's going. You know, the reaction will occur a lot faster once it heats up a little. And this is hydrogen. It'll be alright, just... Oh, no! No, you just got it! What you do? It's trying to fly off! There we go, there we go! Oh shit, I can see like the fumes inside of the balloon. It'll be alright. How did you how did you how did you manage to fucking stretch it's a the gourd cat? balloon? <laughs> That's disgusting. If you can see look at what's going on down here though. That is actually eating away at the aluminum. It's actually quite violent and it's probably super hot. Whoa, yeah it is. I think it just like... We'll top it off then. No, hang on. Try it if you think. I'll let it go a little bit longer. Look, I'll redo it. There we go. Because it was... It's pulling so hard, it's trying to let some of the gas out. By stretching it, it's letting it come in easier so it don't have to force the balloon. There we go. What are you saying when you stroke it? Where is that? I probably should have did that, definitely with my bare hands. Um, yeah, that was a bad idea. I can already feel my fingers burning. Um, let me wipe this off a little. <laughs> Try and tie this. <laughs> uh, oh well, for the sake of the video, I'll just live with chemical burn. I'm good. Um, this should float. Oh yeah. And it works. <laughs>